Welcome to our Arduino component tutorial series. In this episode we'll be taking a look at servo motors. Servo motors are essential components in electronics, commonly used in various applications where precise control over rotational motion is needed. You'll often find servo motors in devices like robotic arms, remote controlled vehicles and automation systems. I will use the Arduino Uno for this video, but this will also work on any other Arduino. Let's take a look at how to set up a potentiometer using Arduino. Here's a simple circuit diagram. To assemble this circuit, you'll need an Arduino, a servo motors, and a few jumper wires. Connect the signal wire, usually colored yellow or white, of the servo motor to a digital PVM pulse width modulation pin on the Arduino, such as 9 or 10. Connect the power wire, usually red, to the 5 volt pin on the Arduino, and the ground wire, usually black or brown, to the ground pin. Servo motors are rotary actuators that allow for precise control of angular position. They typically consist of a DC motor, gearbox and feedback mechanism. The feedback mechanism, often in the form of a potentiometer, provides information about the motor's current position to the control circuitry, allowing for accurate positioning. Servo motors operate based on the principle of PVM, pulse width modulation. The Arduino sends a series of pulses to the servo motors with the width of each pulse determining the position of the motor's shaft. By varying the width of the pulses, the Arduino can control the angle of rotation of the servo motor. Now let's write a simple Arduino program to control the position of the servo motor. Here's the code. This code uses the servo library to control the servo motor connected to pin 9. It moves the servo motor to three different positions, 0 degrees, 90 degrees and 180 degrees, with a delay of one second between each movement. The myServo.write function is used to set the desired angle of rotation of the servo motor. That's it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.